Hey friends, have you made your New Year's resolution yet? Well, when the year is coming to an end and people are all gearing up for the new year, well, people make resolutions like, I want to quit smoking, I want to lose weight, I want to spend some more time with my family and friends. Well, these are the different types of resolutions that people make. But if you have decided to improve your English this coming year, then it's just the right time to learn new phrases and start using them immediately. And that's what we are going to learn in today's lesson. How to wish people a very happy new year. Hey friends, it's me Niharika back with a new lesson for you. Well, today we are going to look at some phrases that would help you to wish others a very happy new year. So how do you do that? Now here we have some phrases for you that you can use with most of your friends, family and business colleagues. So we're going to start with the very first one, which is raising a toast. Now, usually on the 31st of December, most of us are partying and gearing up to welcome the new year. So, most of us are drinking and we raise our glasses and propose a toast. Now, how do you do that when you want to welcome the new years? Well, this is the one that you can use when you are partying with your friends and family. So, when you are all set to raise your glasses, this is the phrase that you can use, which is Cheers to a new year and another chance for us to get it right. Now don't say this with a very sad tone. You have to be really excited. You are having such a great time with your friends. So raise your glasses and Cheers to a new year and another chance for us to get it right. This is the way you can raise a toast on this New Year's Eve. Moving on to another one that I have for you. In fact, it's another way to propose a toast, especially when you are having a good time with your business colleagues or with the people that you work with, maybe your seniors and your peers. So what can you say when you are raising your glasses and proposing a toast? Well, this is a great phrase to use. Cheers for yesterday's achievements and tomorrow's brighter future. So here you're really happy about all the success that you have achieved the past year. And now you're looking forward and being very positive for another great year. So yes, use this phrase when you are with your business colleagues or with your seniors. Say, cheers for yesterday's achievements and tomorrow's brighter future. Okay, so these two phrases can be used to propose a toast. Moving on to another one that I have for you. It's a great way to wish someone or rather wishing your friends and family members. You know, when it's the New Year's time, you really want to touch someone's heart and make the occasion very special. Now, to do so, it's important for you to use the right words. And in English, how do you do that? What are the perfect words to wish someone a very happy New Year? Well, firstly, you would make them feel very special. The first one. You made my year exceptionally amazing, so here's wishing you a very happy new year. So rather than just saying a very happy new year to you, let's make them feel more special by using these words. Trust me, that would really work. You made my year exceptionally amazing, and here's wishing you a very happy new year. Okay, moving on to another one. Again, when you want to share the warmth and the goodwill, what are the perfect words that you can use? May your year be filled with warmth, adoration and cheer. So here, you again want to share great feelings. You want happiness to be spread in their lives. So these are great words that you can use when you are wishing someone. 
So may your ear be filled with warm adoration and cheer. Okay, so use these two phrases when you are with your friends or you are wishing your close friends or family members. Okay, so that's a great phrase to use. And then moving on to another one which I have for you, especially when you are wishing your business colleagues or you are wishing your clients, seniors or peers. Well, please don't miss them out because they are extremely important people in your lives. Am I right? Because friends and family definitely top the list. However, it's important to wish your business people or the people that you work with. So a great phrase to use to wish them a happy new year is may all your endeavors meet huge success. And you can also add another term that may all your endeavors meet huge success and appreciation. So this is the way you can wish uh, probably your boss, okay? You want something nice to happen to him. You want that the new year should be extremely successful for him or for her. So perfect words that you can use to wish a new year to him or her is, may all your endeavors meet huge success and appreciation, all right? And then another one that I have for you that you can use again in the business world is may this new year bring more wonderful opportunities to work together. Now you can use this when you are really looking forward to work with someone and achieve your goals or success. Okay, so probably these are your business clients or your seniors and you are really looking forward to work with them again because your experience with them was just amazing and you do not want to lose an opportunity impressing them. So go ahead and use this phrase in order to wish them a new year, a very happy new year. May this new year bring more wonderful opportunities to work together. Okay, so you got it? When you want to raise a toast, these are the two ways that you can raise a toast or propose a toast on the New Year's Eve. Then moving on to two more phrases that I have for you that you can use with your friends and family members. You made my ear exceptionally amazing and may your ear be filled with warm adoration and cheer. And then the last two phrases you can use for the people that you work with. May all your endeavors meet huge success and may this new year bring more wonderful opportunities to work together. Now these phrases can be used orally or you can also use them when you are texting someone or you are posting these wishes on someone's Facebook page or a Twitter page. So go ahead, use these phrases and make this occasion very, very special. And a very happy new year to all my subscribers out there. Have a wonderful one and stay safe. I'll be back with a new lesson in the new year. Till then, you take care and have a great time. Welcome everyone, I am Neharika and today we are going to look at some New Year idioms. Well, it's that time of the year when resolutions are made, optimism is high and people really want to start fresh. So if you are one of those who would like to make new resolutions, I'm sure these idioms would be extremely helpful to you. So we are going to look at some idioms related to new beginnings. So let's get started. Now when the year comes to an end, I'm sure you're one of those who sits back and introspects and kind of goes through what happened in 2013, right from the good, bad and the ugly. Now there are certain things you can't change, but well I'm sure you are aware of certain things that you could change and you want to change for the better. 
so what you do is you you know you commit to yourself to make a change and that change is called a resolution